1955 Seaberg V200 jukebox. I restored this back in 1989 and 1990. I spent seven months on it. It's July 2017 now. It still plays like a champ. I'm eventually going to have to tear it down though and go through everything, re-oil stuff, dust it. <laughs> but it's a great machine. It spent its entire life here in Las Vegas downtown at a famous bar called Fifth Street Liquors. And now the bar of course is closed but they saved the sign as part of the Neon Museum here in Las Vegas. And I am going to play a song on it so you can see how it works. This is a song from 1980. It's by the B-52s. A little bit of punk, a little bit of soul, a little bit of techno. They're a great group.
Seabergs are great machines. <clears throat> well built, well designed. This one was unique. It had a rotating drum here below. And it pushed the buttons and it shows you 40 songs on each section and there's five sections. It plays a total of 200 songs. Hence the model number V200. It was the first one to do that. It also was uh, high fidelity. See inside here, up behind the keyboard. Over here is where they, you can check how many records it has played over the years, a counter. And of course the back of the machine <coughs> has all the amplifier receiver and speakers. This is considered the Cadillac of all the jukeboxes of the 1950s. This is the one to own. They made this body style for two years. <clears throat> the one after this had a different color scheme. It was chartreuse green and peach. It's a strange color combination and they don't look that great unless they're restored back to their original condition but once they are they light up and they look great but the V200 like this actually <clears throat> is more desirable but hope you enjoyed this little bit of history on the Seaberg V200